Well, this should be interesting because, as you can see, I'm listening to the soundtrack of uh, Kill Bill. <laughs> anyway, so, speaking of the most cleverly disguised fascist government in my previous thingy, I got to laugh. I get to laugh at recent, recent events in Egypt where the military, a benevolent, benevolent entity, served the will of its people and brought down the government. As you can see, I'm reading this script here. See? Script. Whoops. <laughs> wow, that could never happen in America. Our government learned well from the Nazis how important it was to have the military serve only itself for itself. Not the people, mind you, but itself. After all, its first entry on the agenda of things to do is to protect, perpetuate, maintain itself. Plus the shocking reality that our government can, can control Egypt's government, but it can't control its military. Oh my God! How sad! Far be it from our people to understand that, you know, militaries can be benevolent and they don't have to serve the government. They can serve the will of the people. I guess maybe we need our own very secret people serving military. No, I'm not suggesting anything, but I am suggesting. So, this sickest of nations ever to perpetrate its dis ever I'm reading my script here <clears throat> excuse me so this sickest of nations ever to perpetrate its disease upon everyone else well, anyway okay okay, okay. so uh, I want to jump onto one more little subject here okay I have to agree we need to change that in God we trust thing more appropriately, it should be, by God, we're fucked. Which can be interpreted, of course, in a couple of ways. Especially for you religion or people, by God, we're fucked. <laughs> I'll leave you with that, huh? C'est la vie. And don't forget to vote. Oh, I forgot. I forgot to wave my little flag with a swastika on it. God damn it. <laughs>